Jeez, my head. Oh, how far did I fall? Stupid roots. Stupid mountain. Why am I on a bed of flowers? I'm pretty sure I didn't originally fall on a- Why is there a door? Oh, what the heck have I got- Oh. That flower is smiling at me. Oh, it's talking to. Ugh. Howdy! I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Hee hee hee. Why do you make me introduce myself? It's rude to act like you don't know who I am. I don't know who you are. Someone ought to teach you proper manners. Boy, that sounds nefarious. I guess little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go! Oh no. See that heart? That is your soul. The very culmination of your being. Your soul starts off weak, but you can grow strong if you gain a lot of love. What's love stand for? Why love, of course. You want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Please don't. I don't want your love. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around. Get as many as you can. I don't trust you. I don't trust you, flower. Hey, buddy. You missed them. Let's try again, okay? Psych! <laughs> Is this a joke? Are you brain dead? Run into the bullets! A friendliness pellets! Oh, he's mad now. You know what's going on here, don't you? You just wanted to see me suffer. Oh, that that's not gonna be good for my health. Die! Ah. Uh, 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 oh. Ha! Oh, hi. What a terrible creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Ah, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. I don't know that I... You seem nice. What is that? The shadow of the ruins looms above, filling you with determination. HP fully restored. Okay. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. The ruins are full of puzzles, ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the side of them. Okay. Only the fearless may proceed. Brave ones, foolish ones, both walk not the middle road. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. That was very helpful of you, Toriel. Press Z to read signs. Self-explanatory. Stay on the path. I do what I want! I gotta get off the path! See? See how much I'm off the path? Okay, fine. Sorry, I have a headache. Please press this switch, Toriel. <laughs> this one, Toriel? This switch? That switch there? Oh, I guess so. And this switch? Splendid! I am proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. This switch doesn't even work. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. This dummy? You encountered the dummy. You talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for conversation. Toriel seems happy with you. 
You won! You earned zero AXP and zero gold. Ah, very good! You are very good. Well, you know, I've, I've spoken to a lot of dummies in my time. There is another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Uh-oh. It's a frogget! Froggit didn't understand what you said, but was flattered anyway. <laughs> Thanks, Toriel. You won! You earned zero EXP and zero gold. The western room is the eastern room's blueprint. Okay. This is the puzzle, but... Here, take my hand for a moment. Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. Thank you, Toriel. You have done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. All the way to the end of the room, all by myself, huh? I mean, I am- I'm 26 years old, I think I can handle it, Toriel. You better watch out. You better watch out. You better watch out. <laughs> ah, found you. <laughs> Greetings, my child. Do not worry. I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. I must attend to some business, and you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. If you have a need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? Oh my goodness, what's happened to my hair? You gave me a cell phone, Toriel? You used to call me on my cell phone. Oh, hi! Hello, this is Toriel. You have not left the room, have you? There are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try to solve them yourself. Be good, alright? Alright, Toriel. Ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them, they might not want to battle you anymore. If a monster does not want to fight you, please use some mercy, human. Ribbit. Okay, I can do that. I don't want to get in trouble with anybody. Playfully crinkling through the leaves fills you with determination. HP fully restored. Aha! My first chance to strike up a friendly conversation! Aww. Can you not with the flies, though? Oh! I can spare you! Yay, we're friends! Ooh. It says, take one. Take a piece of candy? Yes! You took a piece of candy. Can I take more? I, I mean, it says take one, but no one's around. You took more candy. How disgusting. Oh. Well, I'll, I'll just stick with two then. Aha! It's Froggit again! You deserve it, Froggit. You are very cute. I'm getting some gold. Aww. Whee! Huh. Hello, this is Toriel. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? Definitely cinnamon. Oh, I see. Thank you very much. Butterscotch is just kind of gross. Hello, this is Toriel. You do not dislike butterscotch, do you? I know what your preference is, but would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Right, right. I understand. Thank you for being patient. 
by the way. I actually would turn up my nose, but I would give it a fair try. I'm always up for trying pretty much everything, honestly. Especially when I have a blazing headache from falling several hundred feet almost to my death. Three out of four gray rocks rep recommend you push them. Apparently not that rock. Oh! Hi, Wimson. Oh, you don't want to fight already. Goodbye. Well, there's one rock. Ah. Um. Nope. Ooh. Oh, I see. Ah, this is not the time, Froggit and Winsome. What's with the flies, Froggit? I don't eat those. I understand you're trying to be to be gracious and and giving, and you you were taught to share. But I don't want flies, especially not ones that. Oh gosh, they get in my face. No thank you. You're very generous though. Who is it now? Ooh! You tripped into a line of mold smalls. Oh, none of them want to fight though. Okay. Whoa there, partner! Who said you could push me around? Hmm? So you're asking me to move over? Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Uh, that's not quite far enough, Mr. Rock. Hmm? You want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? Uh, Dwayne, that's the... That's the wrong way. Hmm? That was the wrong direction? Okay, I think I got it. Yes, thank you, friend. Oh, for heaven's sake. Hmm? You wanted me to stay there? You're giving me a real workout. Yes, I know, I'm very picky, but if you could just chill. Ooh. Ha. Knowing the mouse one might one day leave its hole and get the cheese, it fills you with determination. This cheese has been here quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Ugh, gross. Oh, hi there. Gone yet. Zzz. This ghost keeps saying Z out loud repeatedly, pretending to sleep. Move it with force. Um. Uh, can I just poke it? Poke. He did not like being poked. Hi, Naps to Blue. Hey, Naps to Blue. How you doing? I just weigh you down. Oh, don't cry, Naps to Blue. Oh, don't. Especially don't cry like that. Oh gosh, Naps to Bloop. Naps to Bloop is wishing they weren't here. I wish I wasn't here too, Naps to Bloop. <laughs> oh, oh, Naps to Bloop. You're so sad. Just a little bit better. Oh, okay. Here's a joke. Um, why do. Oh, 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 no, don't cry, please. I didn't get to tell my joke. Oh, Naps to Bloop. Well, then we'll cheer you some more. Naps to Blue wants to show you something. Let me try. Oh, don't cry. I call it Dapper Blue. You made a hat out of your own tears. Do you like it? Oh, gee. I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around. But today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Bye, Naps to Blue. I had a good joke to tell you, but I ran out of time. What's over here? Oh! Spider Bake Sale! All proceeds go to real spiders. Ooh! Leave 7G in the web? I didn't have enough gold. It's not even telling me what, what it, it's for. I'll have to come back, I guess. Did you miss it? Spider Bake Sale, down and to the right. Come eat food made by spiders, for spiders, of spiders. Ugh. Hi, frogs. 
as you were. Ooh. M Migosp. Crawled up close. Oh, well, let's spare you. La la, just be yourself. Oh, that's a good dance. Groovy. Oh, I got enough gold for the bake sale. Hooray. Let's go get some. Some spiders crawled down and gave you a donut. Ooh! I have two monster candy and a spider donut. Nice. Hmm. Ooh. Hello. I just realized that it has been a while since I have cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying about here and there. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday you might see something you really like. You will want to leave room in your pockets for that. Thank you, Toriel. That's, uh, pretty smart. There is just one switch. Ah, and I'm guessing... Man, what, what is with the ru- I don't want to fall anymore. I've fallen enough for today. Oh, hey, look at that. But... There's other- Ooh. Oh, hi, guys. Nothing like alone time. I agree. Nothing like it. It's great stuff. There were other things around. I want to say hi to Napstablook again. Hey! I fell down a hole. Now I can't get up. Go on without me. Oh, wait. Ghosts can fly, can't they? Oh, well. Oh, you were so happy for a minute that you were practically stuck. Ooh, what's this? Uh-oh. Looks drew near. Oh, don't pick on him. Finally, someone gets it. Ooh, uh, well then, ah, why are you picking on me? Oh, crap. Looks is gazing at you. Oh, but he doesn't want to fight anymore. Will you people stop picking on me? I've only got eight health left. Oh. Why, everything's a monster. Um. How about we chat? Plants can't talk, dummy. Ah, uh, ooh, ah, uh, oh, now I'm- I always knew the vegetables would get to me- get me. Oh, gosh. Vegetoids here for your health. Okay, so talk didn't work. How about dinner? Oh, good, I can eat you. Eat your greens. Ah, oh, crap. I missed the green. Dang it. Oh, this is tough. Oh, good. Finally. It's easy to grab. Vegetoid gave a mysterious- Oh, good, you don't want to fight anymore. Okay, so the- Don't trust the carrots! I always knew they weren't trustworthy. Uh... No, I'm- I- I, I don't want any more carrots. Oh, what's this about? The far door is not an exit. It simply marks a rotation in perspective. Hmm. If you can read this, press the blue switch. Oh, okay. Well, that. I looks. Yeah, I don't know who's picking on you, looks, but they need to cut it out. We can be friends. It's a switch. Press it. Yeah, sure. You hear a clicking sound. Does that mean? Yes, it means the puzzle has been solved. Ah, another clue. If you can read this. Press the red switch. Okay. Easy enough. Will you people leave me alone? So many switches. I just want to lie down, honestly. That would be great. What does this say? If you can read this, press the green switch. Okay. Not a problem. If that's looks again. Oh, veget oh, it's Vegetoid and Migos. Great. Um
Oh, oh gosh. Dang it. Oh gosh. Can I just- I can flee. Oh gosh. I don't have enough health to take them both on at once. What's over here? Ribbit, ribbit. Just between you and me. I saw Toriel come out of here just a little while ago. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too intimidated to talk to her. Ribbit. Aww. But she's- ooh! You found the toy knife. Oh, nice! I can pretend to protect myself. Oh, Oh, dear. That took longer than I thought it would. Oh. Sorry. Hi. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? Who did this to you? You will get an apology. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. Er, well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. Seeing such a cute, tidy house in the ruins gives you determination. Aw, it's Toriel's house. Do you smell that? Surprise! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on snail pie for tonight. Here, I have another surprise for you. Really? This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. It's very, very quick to adopt me into your family. Is something burning? Um, make yourself at home. Okay. Bye, Toria. Aww. It's my own room. An empty photo frame. It's really dusty. A box of kids' shoes in a disparity of sizes. Aww. A Can I get in bed? <gasps> oh, I can. Oh. Good night. Ooh. No, I want to go back to bed. Pie? You found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Aww. Yum. You have seen this type of plant before, but do not know its name. It's Toriel's diary. Read the circled passage. You read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling bonely. The rest of the page is filled with jokes of a similar caliber. Okay. Definitely bigger than a twin-sized bag bed. It's an encyclopedia of subterranean plants. You open to the middle. Typha, a group of wetland flowering plants with brown oblong seed pods, more commonly known as water sausages. You peek inside. <gasps> Scandalous! It's Toriel's sock drawer. <laughs> inside the drawer are flower seeds and some broken crayons. It's you! Room under renovations. Hmm. Well, Nice little house you have here, Toriel, but it looks like you shouldn't be living here alone. It's awfully big to be all by yourself. I wonder what's down here. 